Vitamin E can protect your cells, but more isn't better, and it can be bad for men, and I'll get into why later. And it's highly, highly unlikely that you're deficient in vitamin E because it's in lots and lots of foods, plus supplement companies hide it in things without telling you. Human studies show that vitamin E supplements are not anti-cancer and they don't offer any cardiovascular benefits and they've been shown to increase the risk of prostate cancer in healthy young men. There are eight different forms of vitamin E. I'm not going to go into it in detail. Alpha tocopherol is the most used in the body, the most common, but has the most side effects. And then there's tocotrenols that are not well studied. So if somebody tries to sell you a super duper vitamin E, it's that. And nobody has any idea if it's even better, superior or even safe. And like I said, most people don't even need a vitamin E supplement anyway, unless you've got established macular degeneration, an advanced form of fatty liver disease, or you've got a condition where you can't absorb fat. Feel free to comment, follow for more science. Thanks for watching.